Hey y'all, so I am bringing you my six month dread update. <laughs> It's been two months since my last update and my dreads have changed so much. They made this like crazy turn around the corner which has been amazing and I absolutely love it and so I figured I would share it with you. Um, since that time, you know, my dreads still have crazy loops and um, are continually continuously shrinking and as they do that they have these like funky things happening and I still have loose hair and and stuff like that but the major difference is I the dreads itself have started to really mat and form into real feeling dreadlocks so um, the ones on top which are a little bit younger only by a couple days but they still have a little bit more of a rope feel, but they are definitely starting to feel softer and more matted. But the ones that are towards the side and especially in the back of my head and more underneath are like really nice and matted and really shrinking up well. Like some of them are only up to here. Um, these other ones are still a little bit longer, but I will show you. So um, in my previous videos, I started from down here. So now I'm almost up to shoulder length. So I've lost a lot of um, length, but they're, they're just like, you can see, they're just really matting nicely and they're getting soft and um, they're just, see, they're like, you know, really just, I don't know. I just, you know, obviously I still palm roll after I, I uh, shampoo them and I, still wash them once a week and actually last week I went to almost two full weeks and had no issues at all no issues with scalp or dandruff or anything I'm gonna put the video link here of my last video where I go over what I um, shampoo my dreads with because for $1.25 you can't beat it and there's absolutely no residue I love it so instead of wasting your money on dreadlock products which I feel like is a scam anyway um, just go simple and go with a more natural soap and it's been amazing for me so I want to share that at least so definitely check that video out and I explain everything in there but um yeah so this big change has been a more the more um, feeling of matted hair and really shrinking up and really tightening and because it feels so good I just feel totally comfortable wearing my hair down now in public. I go out baseball games and food shopping and I don't feel like I need to tie it back or make it as styled as much because trying to you know take people's attention away from it because it was like all still crazy and very rope like looking and you know it, it just they were very young dreads and um and they still are i mean i'm only at six months so there's still a lot of loose hair and there's still a, a long ways to go you can obviously see there's you know lots of these nubs and small ones forming but i just feel so much more comfortable with them and so much more natural um these younger ones on top still have a little bit of the rope feeling because they don't get as much hair um, and a lot, and as much friction as these other ones do to get it into that um, matted dreadlock look. So yeah, so that's where I'm at and I'm really loving them. You can see here I have some ends getting sucked up into this dread which is really a nice looking one. Let me see if I can show you a little bit better. Sorry. No. So. <laughs> Um, so that end is gonna kind of shrink up in here and it I have some in the back that don't have any of these um, you know paintbrush tips anymore they're they're blunted in the back and you can't really see them because they're really small they're only like this big now <laughs> so um, but I love it and they're doing their own thing and it's working its way out so you just you know if you have new dreads and you're in that messy stage and everything is just kind of 
all over the place just stick with it because it starts to really evolve and and your hair knows what to do in its natural state so um yeah it's been great and so i still shampoo it with the same shampoo i shampoo it once a week still maybe and usually longer and definitely between seven to nine days is usually my norm and i don't use any other products except for the soap and i palm roll only when they're wet after i wash them so i palm roll a little bit just to get some of the frizz if it's like really looking crazy when they're dry but primarily i separate them after i wash them and in you know in case they're starting to congo a little bit and i separate them and i palm roll them after i wash them when they're wet and that has been the best time for me to do that the other thing is um i don't have any dreads really congoing anymore so the first four months they really wanted to attach to each other and now they're kind of in their own separate entities and they're not wanting to attach as much so i don't have to go through them every single day and pulling them apart so i still work through them every few days but it wasn't as much as when they were a little bit younger so i'm looking forward to the next six months but they're coming out great if you have any questions at all definitely leave them in the comments below i love talking about them and um you know answering any questions that i can as much as i can i know they're not fully mature yet but they're coming along and if there's anything i can help with or anything at all or if you want to see any videos of how i take care of them or anything specific let me know for sure i love reading your comments and i will definitely get back to you and so that's where we're at that's that's it I'm loving it and i feel good and if you're debating getting them i would definitely say try it out because go with your heart go with your instinct and it'll all work out in the end <laughs> so cheers and happy Mm -hmm. The one my heart is gone to me, not gone to wait, 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 wait.